EA Sports, and the PGA Tour. So proud to present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, we bring you live final round coverage of the Arnold Palmer Invitational, presented by MasterCard. What a week and weekend this has been so far. Everything you want in a golf tournament. By nightfall, we will have our winner. As you take a look at the current leaderboard on this Sunday afternoon, our leader here on this Sunday is our featured golfer. He's on top by three as he gets set to begin play. And that is going to miss the fairway as his opening tee shot is in the rough. It's okay, not ideal, but um, manageable from there. And this is not going to get there, but it will find a safe spot between the front two bunkers here at this first hole. The strike was fine on the pitch shot. Ball first, then turf. Just wasn't really hit hard enough. No. Okay, it's a bogey here at first. And this is going to drop that lead down to three shots. And this is going to be in the short grass just off to the left. A little short-sided here, left of the green for his second. Lovely pitch shot. Just nipped that ball off the turf. Just flew through the air beautifully. Set down fairly quick as well. Good shot. Yeah, well done. That's in for par. And this is going to stay a two-shot lead. driving has been sensational all week, and here's another one that's going to set up nicely in the fairway. Walking the course today, let's bring in Nota Begay the third. 142 yards left to the hole, pin in the back. And safely on deck. That's the main thing, but from that distance, really don't want to leave yourself like a knee knocker, like a four or five footer. So this first putt's going to have to be good. Nah, that's going to wander off to the right and leave maybe two, three feet coming back. He'll finish that one off with no problem. It's in for par. And that cushion's going to remain two shots. Now from way back, better than 300 yards, a second to the par five. Well, just a good solid shot right there with that three wood, Frank. 
That's an aggressive layup, really, trying to force that three wood down and get it as close as possible to the green. That's two good shots if you can't reach the par five. Okay, a little left to do, but safely on the green. 12 feet still to go. That one just gonna sneak on by. Okay, that one finished off for a par. And the lead will remain one. Well, it's 74 yards here as he's set for his second. Oh, that is how you get to be world number one. A beautiful shot there to get it in tight. Nicely played. It's a birdie at the fifth. He's going to move to 23 under par. The wind's starting to push this one a little left. The driving's been sensational all week, and here's another one that's gonna set up nicely in the fairway. Really hit that second shot on the button to this par five, but Frank couldn't get it to stop. Yeah, too good, too long, sadly. A nine footer now for his birdie. Well done. It's back-to-back -back birdies here on this front side. And that's going to move him to 24 under par. And he maybe didn't want to risk going over, so this ball well short of the hole and a long look coming up for birdie. Now a seven footer. Let's do this. Mm, didn't trust the read there, and that's gonna cost him. That one in, it is a bogey here at the seven. And fortunately the lead's still a comfortable one. A full four shots. Well, you can't walk out and drop it any better than that. That is a fine tee shot right there. Second shot straight ahead, and we go to Iona Steven. 
Yes, it's 126 yards left to the flag and that pin, well, it's back left today. Now it's a decent sized green, it's not bad, just a little past the hole. Perfect there, down the slope, it's in for a birdie. And he will definitely not say no to that. And that is dead center, right down the middle here to start the hole. Second shot now, and has to be careful because that breeze can be tricky at his back. You don't want to over club. Oh, this could be good. A touch long, a touch lift. But still, how good can he puff? It is a birdie here at the ninth, and he'll go out in 34, two under par for this front side. Another great tee shot. By my count, only missed one fairway today, so that's seven of eight. Easy to see that's the best way to play this golf course. Kane cut back left here today as he stares down his second to the par four. A touch long, a touch left. But still, how good can you putt? Ten foot putt left. Just a hair off target. And those are the ones that'll drive you crazy. So that's in for par to start this backside. And the lead will remain six here in the late going. And this, a tee shot that fits the eye, and that'll be just fine. So, Iona, this his second from the fairway. 125 is the number, just a flick, pin, front right. It's a sneaky one. Ah, good shot again there. Well thought out. Landing the ball short, let the ball run onto the green. And inside, well, I'd call that a birdie putt. So that's birdie range. Oh, yes. Plenty of pace to get up that slope. It is in for a birdie. And stop the presses if you've heard this before. He's well on his way to yet another victory on the year. Looks so simple when you're going good, doesn't it? And that is yet another solid drive.
that one had to feel good. Yeah, struck it so well, you could see that by the reaction of that ball when it hit the green. Landed so softly. Eight feet remaining here for birdie. Uh, nicely done. Two straight birdies here early on this backside. And the lead is up to a full six shots on the rest of the field. Good risk driver, but why? Just hit three wood down there, leave a nice yardage, knock it on the green, maybe make birdie. Just under 80 yards to go now as he'll decide how to flight his second. Oh, well, that hit the flag stick. you're hoping for from that number but no damage it's on the green Iona this a birdie putt well for a long putt like this there's really not a whole lot to it I think you'll fancy his chances at this one oh do that what a roll that was. A long one in for birdie. And this lead continues to widen. It is just a procession now, as the difference is eight shots at the top of this leaderboard. Didn't check, Frank. Yeah, just not enough spin on that, um, really. I mean, that almost like took that first bounce and just ricocheted forward. Mm, that is a good looking pass out of the bunker right there. Got that to stop in a good place, leaving just a few feet for par. Okay, safely in for his par. And pars to the clubhouse will do nicely as this remains a giant eight-stroke cushion. Ah, solid. Good drive in the fairway. From the fairway, Iona, this is second. Yes, 135 yards left to the flag and the pin on the back portion in the left-hand side of this green. And that not quite gonna hold the green, but that'll be okay. how you do it right there. The approach misses the target, but the putter coming through from off the green, and that is a bit of a surprise birdie. Oh, the rhythm is definitely there today. Another wonderful tee shot. Now a big spot here for something good. This is a short second to the par five. All right, 
never a doubt going for it in two. And Frank safely aboard here at the 16th at Bay Hill. Exactly, Rich. Not an overly long par five. Very scorable. And that's what we expect. Some days you just can't miss, and this is one of those days. What a putt there, as he'll walk away with an eagle. Okay, that one's dancing. This is a 16-footer. Oh, needed just a little bit of a turn, but that will somehow stay right on the edge. No problems there. That's a par here at 17. And pars will be no problem from here on out as this will remain a full 10-shot lead. Yes, step one out of the way. It is in the fairway at 18. One more good approach shot could just about seal it. This is where club selection is so important. Second shot into that stiff breeze. Well, had a good look at the green, but couldn't cash it in. In the rough now, wondering what might have been. I think I'd be fairly pleased with that, Frank. What do you think? I certainly do. It was so, so good. Yes, what a final round this was from being on the outside looking in to a big lead. As we'll watch and wait, but this certainly must feel like this will be a victory. Frank, always nice to test yourself at one of the game's great venues, the Bay Hill Club and Lodge. What a day. Yeah, and you know you've played a golf course where the PGA Tour has visited for so many years. So you, like the best players in the world, great opportunity to test your skills. For Frank Navalo and all of us here at EA Sports, I'm Rich Lerner saying so long until next time.